Hey guys, welcome. Thank you very much for joining me in this video. It's going to be a quick video. Pretty much it's the second time around. I've done a video about ARM holdings before. And so the IPO is coming up and I thought I'd make a second video um, and uh, let people know about the changes since my last video. So my first video on ARM holdings was two weeks ago. And it's kind of sad because for some reason, I guess some people don't know it existed. Even though this this is the screenshot you're watching right now of that video it was two weeks ago, as you can see here on the bottom, didn't see it. I don't know. They're asking me where is it? Why you didn't make an ARM uh, IPO video? So I do every IPO video. I, I do it. I do a full review and analysis of every IPO. You can search that, guys, in the search um, um, part of the channel. There's a, pro, a part of the profile near the about section, where after that there's a search you can click on and type in the name of a company and the video will pop up. On September 5th, Arm Holdings said today that uh, we announced that it has launched a roadshow for the initial public offering. A total of 95.5 million American depository shares are being offered by the selling shareholder, a wholly owned subsidiary of SoftBank, which I've said in my previous video, um, in the IPO. Arm expects the selling shareholder to grant the underwriters an option to purchase up to additional 7 million shares. It says 47.51, everyone says that. And you know, they're telling me, hey Mike, you know, it's gonna be 50 bucks, that's not bad. Um, look, from experience, I know that IPOs like this one, they say price, but that's not actually the price it opens. So I am almost 99.99% sure that it's not gonna open at 51, guys. Going up on 60, 70, 80 bucks, somewhere around there, maybe higher, but 60 for sure minimum. So it's gonna be higher for us on day one when it starts trading. Other people are asking me, Mike, where can I pre-order this? You cannot pre-order this. It's not available for pre-order anywhere. You're just gonna to have to trade it the, on the day that it starts trading. So it starts trading on September 14, 2023. 47 to 51 bucks. And the ticket symbol will be ARM. Now this is a company that creates and licenses CPU technologies for various technologies. Your cell phones, 99% of all cell phones have some type of ARM semiconductor in them. Cambridge UK based company was founded to enable advanced computing using power efficient semiconductor design technologies. Management is headed by Chief Executive Officer Rene Haas who has been with the company since 2013. Mr. Haas was previously the Vice President General Manager at Computing Product Products Business at NVIDIA, so that's pretty cool. And management estimates that 70% of the world's population uses ARM-based products, which is insane. In my first video, I showed you full detail and analysis of their financials. We'll look at that again because it's amazing, guys, if you um, look at their um, uh, gross margin, which is insane. Now, regarding the existing potential new shareholders, there's an interest of up to $735 million worth of American depository shares to be bought at the, uh, at the initial public offering price by AMD, Apple, Google, NVIDIA, Samsung, TSMC, just to name a few. If you look at the revenue of the company, it is you know, very strong revenue, $2.7 billion, 2.6, almost 2.7 again in 2023, slight decrease. And, no, and there's also a notable slight decrease of negative 2.5% in 2023 for the first three months, should end also on the negative side for the whole year because of the supply chip shortage, the economy as a whole slowdown and all that stuff, right? So that has an effect, but you know, it's a great company, so it should bounce back when the economies start rolling again. Gross profit loss went from 2.5 to $2.5 billion. Gross margin is insane. I've never seen such a huge company IPO with this insane, gorgeous gross margin of 95%. Operating profit loss from 633 million to 671. Net income loss went from 549 to 524 million, and the cash flow from operations guys from 458 to 739 million. Valuation score now we can give it a good valuation score. In the previous valuation score on my first video, I gave it a four because I didn't know the initial price, um, the uh, the IPO price. Now we know that the IPO price will be in the $50 range, but like I said, don't expect that to actually be that. It should open a lot higher than that. Um, but overall, I do give it a five because this is a great company, a strong company, one that I believe will go up on day one for sure and over the long term should do very well also. Hopefully, um, it's not overpriced, although I th you know it is. It's clear that they will bring it to us um, a bit overpriced, 
but um, you know we'll see uh, within the next six to ten months one year after it starts trading it'll settle down um, where and it will be corrected at some point not too much you know don't expect any huge drops this is a very strong company thank you very much for watching this video and I wish you all the best take care are you looking for a discord platform that offers a first-class trading community that's what you can expect when you join bull market watch trading can be challenging for some people but we're here to simplify the process for you we have a very powerful track record our Discord deals with day trades, swing trades, and long-term trades. Hundreds of traders operate through our Discord, where we come up with stocks to trade for profits on the NASDAQ and in YSE. With a low monthly subscription of $9.90, you will have full access to our Discord, where you can interact with other traders and get all the latest news when it comes to trading as well. It's a community that is extremely supportive of one another and always willing to help each other out. Become a member of Bull Market Watch today and be on your way to a better financial situation.